There's a man in the 1850s in Boston, Massachusetts named Edward Kimball. And Edward Kimball was a Sunday school teacher. We called it Sunday school, Bible life, connect group, y'all come, howdy time, whatever we call it. It's, it's a great time. And so Edward Kimball, 1850s, Boston, Massachusetts, he, he walks to the shoe, the shoe store because there's a young boy there, a young man. He's 16 years of age. He only has a fourth grade education. You with me? Fourth grade education. He's 16 years of age. He's working, providing, helping provide for his family. And Edward Kimball sees something special in this young man. And he begins to witness to him and share the gospel with him. And in the back room in this shoe store in Boston, Massachusetts in the 1850s, Edward Kimball led this young lad to Christ. That young lad went on to lead one million people to Christ. A million people he led through his preaching. You say, well, what in the world was his name? Couldn't be Billy Graham. You're talking 1850, not 1950. His name was Dwight Lehman Moody, D.L. Moody. How many of you have ever heard the name of Moody? Moody Bible Institute, Moody Church, so forth, amen. How many of you raised your hand have heard of Edward Kimball? Not many. He was an Andrew. So don't minimize or mitigate your witness because you never know who it is that God would save like a Mordecai Ham would be preaching and a Billy Graham would come and be saved.